At the bottom of Jervis Bay, Australia, something extraordinary has taken shape. It isn't coral. It isn't natural rock. It's a city built by octopuses. Shells, bones, debris, all gathered, arranged, and shaped into something astonishing. A clustered network of dens built side by side in close quarters by Octopus Tetricus, the gloomy octopus. And the strangest part? They're not supposed to do this. Octopuses are thought to be solitary, lone thinkers, creatures that live, hunt, and die in silence. But here, something different is happening. They're building, interacting, fighting, sharing space. Some have called it Octlantis, a submerged neighborhood made of discarded shells and bones. Each octopus constructs its own den, but they exist within a few meters of one another, like a row of tiny alien homes. And the behavior? It's complicated. They steal from neighbors, chase off intruders. Some octopuses even eject others by blasting them with jets of water. Is this cooperation, competition, territoriality? Or is it the beginning of culture, 